How's everybody? Chaz out on Georgia Baseball Lessons. Uh, you know, a couple things we've been talking about, you know, and I'm gonna kind of walk, do the, do the walk and talk. Um, a few things we've been talking about from the coaching standpoint, you know, and even as players watching this, you know, you know, my thing is is really, you know, enthusiasm. There was a guy that did a, was, was my minor league, uh, he was my, our field coordinator named Rick Sofield. Gosh. This guy had enough enthusiasm. I'd run through a wall. I mean, I mean, he got us all jacked up, man. He just, just a great guy, and uh, fired up with a lot of energy, um, you know. And uh, you know, also, um, you know, he, I think sympathy. Um, I wouldn't say that with with uh, with, with uh, Rick, but uh, yeah, I, I, Rick didn't coach me at the big league level, so he, so at, at the level that I was at, you know, he, there, there wasn't much sympathy. Um, but be interested in your players and their problems. You know, also self-control. You know, exercise good judgment without being emotional. I think our emotions get the best of us a lot of the times. And, and sincerity, you know, uh, insincerity, you know, is gonna be spotted quickly. It can cause a lot of respect, okay? Uh, sincerity, insincerity can be spotted quickly and can cause loss of respect. Um, when you get to the higher levels, and your people spot things. And uh, I'm not gonna go with the old saying, if you spot it, you got it. But you know, you know, the jobs of a minor league coordinator and or a major league, you know, guys are to watch guys, to watch what's going on, learn what they're doing, go up and talk to them in the morning. But at the same time, you have to write your reports. And you have to, it's your job. Your reports go, hey, how's your, how's your legs feeling? How's your hamstring feeling? So players remember. Um, I'm not saying if you got a sore hammy, you know, but stay out of the training office. I was one of those guys who'd get to get to stretch, you know, in the morning and do all that stuff. But uh, I found out, you know, later in my career, stay stay away, stay out of the training room, and uh, you know, how you feeling today? Feeling great, outstanding, feeling great. You know, so from the playing standpoint, that's how you feel. From the coaching standpoint, you know, that's how you can learn your players too. Who's, who's going to be there when, when the time counts? Who do you need to pinch hit? Um, how do you figure out your lineup? You start asking questions. You start seeing who shows up for practice. You know, a guy once told me, if you get there early and you stay there late, you're going to stick around for a while. End on that one. Chaz out of GeorgiaBaseballLessons.com. Have a great day today. And uh, GeorgiaBaseballLessons.com, 407-454-1770. Subscribe, see below. All my information is below. Have a great one.